Hello, you two. I ain't seen one of these in a while, baby. <laughs> Hello, hello, hello. Well, hello there. I am Laura Laurent. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please feel free to roam around and in that time frame, if you like what you see, please by all means subscribe to the channel. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for hanging around. I see I have a trickle of a couple of people that done came in since I, um, since I uploaded or released, because a lot of times I be having stuff uploaded, but I just never make it public. You know what I'm saying? So for those of you who have been here, thank you so much for being a part of the community, a part of the tribe here. And if you are new, hey, how you doing? How you doing? Um, yo, this is <laughs> my microphone. My microphone. I know y'all saw on them videos ooh, where I was having all those issues. I was having all those issues with my microphone and the humming and being in the left channel and not the right channel or the right channel, not the left channel and having to correct it and post and edit and all of this type of stuff. And it was just too much stuff that was going on and I could not figure out for the life of me well, I, I had an idea of what was going on with my audio and why my mic was not really operating at its full capacity, its full potential without the humming. And come to find out it was that stupid ring light. Yeah, it was the ring light that was causing the problem. So anyways, I wanted to come on here and do a get ready with me. I've never done a get ready with me before. Am I going anywhere? No, okay, but I am getting ready to vlog. And so I need to have, you know, I would like to have my makeup done. My brows are not done, I just realized it. So I need to go ahead and get myself together so that I can vlog in a few minutes. And you know, your girl gotta get it together, you feel me? I gotta get it together, please thank. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my brows right quick. Well, shave my brows because I don't have time for the plucking because it is already, what time it is? Because I gotta go get my child. It's 3.24. I normally pick him up about 4.30, no later than five o'clock, sometimes 5.30, but yeah. So let me go ahead and do that, okay? And we're gonna get started. We're just gonna go ahead and get started with this. So I'll be right back. So the brows are done, honey. The brows are done. And so what we're gonna do is use our Fenty Soft Silk Hydrating Primer to prime our skin, which I should have done that. I should have done that before putting like filling in my brows, but you know, when you haven't done your makeup in a long time, you know, when you haven't done your makeup in a long time and you <laughs> sit down to do it, you just be missing all kind of steps. Like you be forgetting to put primer on, like, you know, you be forgetting it, like blend this out under the lip. Like it just be all kind of stuff, baby. I think we're just gonna do something very simple because we're getting ready to vlog and I don't want anything to whoosh, you know what I mean? So I feel like doing a very simple eyeshadow look, like neutral eyeshadow look is going to be uh, top tier in this sense, you know? Maybe I feel like I'm sitting here and I don't know what I'm doing. Why do I feel like I don't know what I'm doing? First of all, Laura, you need an eyeshadow palette. 
whenever I'm trying to do like a quick makeup look, typically I'll just reach for my Mel Cosmetics Rust Stack. But I was leaning towards this Juvia's Place, the Warrior 2 palette. I really like it. We're gonna use the Fenty Beauty uh, Pro Filter Instant Retouch Concealer. This is in the shade 330. I think I have 360 as well. Maybe I should use 360. Let's go ahead and use 360. I'm gonna use this concealer to prime my lids. Do I have a primer? I do. Do I wanna use it? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. I need another mirror, makeup mirror, because one or two years ago, my son broke this one. <laughs> unfortunately, darling, unfortunately. Anyways, we're gonna use uh, my RCMA powder. <laughs> Right? I'm gonna use RCMA to set it. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, I really miss doing my YouTube videos. <laughs> I do, I miss doing my YouTube videos. I miss filming. I love editing and filming. Like, I really like doing all of this stuff. The only thing is, I don't get paid to do it. And I absolutely love doing it. I just don't do it enough. I don't do it as often. And I really need to start getting in here and filming. And I told myself that I was going to start taking like a mental health day for myself, like once or twice a month. And, um, yeah, taking a mental health day like once or twice a month and just coming in here after I drop my son off at school and just film. That's really what I was telling myself and then I never do it. I just be like, oh, well, I'ma just wait until I take a vacation or something. And then the vacation comes and I'm like so exhausted from waiting until I'm taking a vacation until, uh, um, I'm so exhausted from waiting so long to take a vacation until by the time I take the vacation, all I do is sleep. And that's what happened the last time I tried to take a vacation. It wasn't nothing but just PTO. It wasn't no doggone vacation. And then it went by so fast. And I feel like I got nothing accomplished except cooking and cleaning. And it's like, well, no, you don't wanna do that. You wanna just, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. So this is the Morphe M433 brush. It's kind of flat. It's kind of flat and wide. So I'm gonna go in, what is this? The Warrior 2, and I'm gonna go in with Yodit. I'm gonna go in with Yodit. That's this uh, kind of medium, medium to light brown shade here, tan. It looks kind of cool, like a cool tone. So I'm gonna apply this all over my lid. Okay. Put that all over the lid. Like I said, this is a very quick makeup look. I get the feeling that this, I'm gonna end up dragging this out simply because I want it to be quick. Y'all know how that work out. Whenever you want something to be quick, it takes a heck of a lot longer than you expect, you know? But when you want something to be long and drawn out, it seems like it goes by extremely fast. It's crazy. I think this is Kafuru. This is like a deeper brown tone. So I am deepening my crease with this. Okay. I'm deepening the crease. And then after we deepen the crease, we're gonna take a clean fluffy brush and we're going to blend this puppy out okay we definitely want to blend that out so i have a sonia kashuk brush that i typically use to blend out it's just a large fluffy clean large fluffy brush that i like to use to blend everything out okay even though I don't have any harsh lines, I still like to diffuse it just to give it more of a softer blend. I am not the queen of blending, okay? I am not the master of blending. 
I'm gonna leave that to the pros. All right, all right, okay. <laughs> this is a Sephora brush. Don't ask me what the number is on here because this thing has been rubbed off. I've used it, oh, ha <laughs> This is the Taper Pro Taper Crease Brush, the Sephora number 19. It is a number on there. I'm gonna go in with Dara, you know, like Laura, Laura Laurent, you get it? So it's Dara, it's this kind of rose, uh, rose pink here, and I'm gonna, Dab that right in the inner V. Just like that. Because I do need to lighten that up just a little bit. I mean, we're vlogging. We're not going out on a date, okay? <laughs> I think we went a little overboard, but it's quite all right, okay? <laughs> Let's go ahead and color correct. I'm using the number GC990. This is the orange color corrector. This is the orange color corrector from uh, LA Girl Pro Concealer. Y'all know this is the old school. Y'all know it's the old school jam, okay? And I still use it. So we're, gonna, we're just color correcting. I'll take the excess and just put it around my mouth like so um i've noticed that i can do a lighter coverage with the color corrector uh because i don't have um i've been using a kit to get rid of the dark circles under my eyes so that's been a good thing i definitely need to go back to sephora and get color matched because I don't think that this is what, 410? I think 410 might be good. I have not really been outside like talking about it. Um, so I don't know, but I have three different shades of foundation because you know, melanated skin, like we're like magic. We can change colors throughout the year. Mm -hmm. I am tempted to use a brush instead of a sponge because I have not used a brush to put on foundation in such a very long time. And this, uh, I don't know, I guess this is kind of weird to me because I, I haven't used a brush in a very long time. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what I want to do for my birthday. Um, I don't know if I want to get my lips done. I don't know if I want to just stay at home. I'm going to take 330 <laughs> Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Instant Retouch Concealer in 330 and do a little bit of brightening under the eye on the chin, forehead, center of the nose, maybe here. <sighs> mm. I am gonna take my beauty blender and let uh, try to blend this out. Try to, I am gonna blend it out, what? Oh, I hope this works. It's like, get ready with me to vlog. Girl, I'm going downstairs and vlog, honey. I ain't going to what's special. <laughs> I am not going anywhere special, okay? <laughs> okay, so the 330, I don't think the 330 is that bad or like brightening, it's not that bad. So typically the day before I vlog, I try to do a test setup just to make sure that the lighting is gonna be good so that the next day 
so that the next day or whatever, when I get ready to film, I'm not fumbling or doing anything like that uh, to set up the lights and stuff like that, you know. This is a foundation stick from Juvia's Place in the shade Zambia. So it's a very dark, rich, deep shade. And I use this to um, contour. Now I'm just going to take my Laura Mercier translucent powder. Y'all know this is like my go-to. I have others, I have Fenty. Fenty is really good as well. I don't know why I pulled out my Laura Mercier, probably because I'm just used to pulling it out, you know? But we're just gonna use a uh, good old Laura Mercier here to set under the eyes. Okay. So I'm leaving you behind. I can't wait for that shit. <laughs> Boy, they going to tour. It is all over, baby. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going in with Coco Naughty from Fenty. I haven't done anything else. I just set uh, under my eyes and I pretty much was saying that I don't do the whole baking thing, you know, so yeah. So I don't, I don't know if I want to get my lips done for my birthday. At first I wanted to get a hand tattoo, but I, just, <laughs> I don't know if that's going to be like a thing that I should do. So now that we have done a little bronzer and you know, just kind of setting the, ooh, remo, setting the contour. I have a few items from the Black Panther collection um, from MAC, and this is a, what is this? Oh, I have all kind of stuff in here, y'all. This is, I need to go through all this new makeup. Anyways, um, I have this highlighter and I've barely used it. This is called Royal Vibrancy, and it is so pretty. Um, I used it a couple of times but I, I don't think that I filmed myself using it, but look at that. You can't tell me, it just, <laughs> you just wanna use it. You know what I'm saying? Okay, this is better. This is the one from Artist Couture. I don't know why I like this one better. I don't know, maybe because it's like a, a lot fluffier than the other one. All right, I don't know why it's like that. I don't know, I think that's why. It's just a lot fluffier than the other one. And I feel like it really, when you put the highlighter on, why am I even putting on highlighter? I don't even know. But when you put the highlighter on, it really gives a soft, a soft glow, you know? I'm kind of old school with hobbies on my makeup. I, I don't know. I'm not into all of the trends and stuff like that anymore. I just like doing my makeup. That's it. I just like doing my makeup. Be fool in this game for two. Oh, oh, baby. Yeah, when I first bought Construct, I was like, man, I am not gonna like it. But come to find out I liked it. <laughs> Let's go ahead and do the mascara. And then after I do the bottom and top lashes, I, I don't know. I might do like, uh, smoke out the bottom a little bit with the brown. Um, Kafuru or something like that from the eyeshadow palette. So I'm gonna go on the bottom lid with Jamada. This is Jamada here. It's like a cognac color. And we're gonna do Jamada under here. I think I'm gonna mist my face once more and then put on like a nude lipstick. Um, 
I'm not gonna do lashes. I was, but I'm not gonna do it because it's pointless. It's pointless to do the lashes. I really like my makeup. <clears throat> so this lip pencil is in the shade Chestnut. This is from MAC. So let's see how it looks with the wig. I don't even know what a wig at, but um, we'll just go downstairs. <laughs> we'll just go downstairs and set up the camera and stuff like that with the light. And I will see y'all down there for the finished look. I know y'all were expecting a ginger wig and I had the ginger on at first, but it was just a little too much. So I decided to put this one on to kind of calm the atmosphere down a little bit. So anyways, I hope that you enjoyed that little quick get ready with me to vlog content makeup tutorial that I did and a little bit of rambling that I had going on in the video. Um, I really appreciate you watching. If you haven't already, please make sure you hit the subscription button and join the fam. Um, if you would like to follow me on Instagram, I will have all of that in the description box. And yeah, I hope to see you in the next video. Bye. You are considering... Okay. He's got a loose tooth. Now he wants me to wiggle his tooth. Wait. Oh, it is. Okay. It's gonna come out. He always wants me to touch the tooth. Here comes my son, and I can guarantee you he's gonna pop his little head into the video. Three, two, there he is. Mommy. Yes. What's your name? Mommy, what's your name? Well, what? Thank you. Do you say ram? No, we're not gonna do ram anymore, okay? We don't have the dead cat on here. Check it out. I see that, Thomas. Thomas scared. He's scared? Yeah. What is he scared of? The what this. The who? Look at that. <laughs> okay, I see that. You gonna let me film this? Mm -hmm. You sure? You mesmerized by the screen? Yeah. Mm. A tree. This is why I have to film when he's not. This is why I have to film when he's either not around or he's asleep. Because this happens. Hello, hello. Welcome back to much. Oh my God. Joining the tribe.